And so we're just gonna go up here and talk to Anella, the new archaeologist on duty here for the Foundation Archaeological Park Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun Foundation here in Visoko, Bosnia. Okay. So this is the lowest archaeological dig here in the Bosnian Pyramid of the Sun. And we have this incredible artificial material really, really, really hard aspects of concrete and we see the, the layering of the different materials on this. We see the inclination into the structure and we see how it's inclined to the right directly into the structure. Then we see the texturing uh, of it. Very interesting. There's more evidence of texturing up here. And I'll just get a nice, we'll get a nice shot of that. So we see that this is absolutely not natural, but textured like m most of the other construction stones here at the Bosnian Pyramid of the Moon, Bratnica Tumulus. Why they spent so much time texturing these blocks is unknown. Good. Good. Super. Super. Dobar, huh? Yes, dobar. So, Mera, what's happening? Oh, we are fixing some stuffs. We are preparing Pyramid of the Sun for next season. Okay. Yeah. And so, what are you doing to prepare exactly? Uh, we are making this um, stairway. Stair, yeah. Stairs. Oh, you're fixing the stairway. Okay. Yeah. 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 And so are you... Me, me and Danila, we are cleaning the, the blocks oh. up there. Okay, yeah. the, the uh, concrete um, blocks. Soil, vegetation, and so Super, et super. The, the ones that the volunteers uncovered over the years. Yeah. They got dirt on them, so you're cleaning them. Yeah. Fantastic for the tourists. Um, so what's your position with the Archaeological Park Foundation? What do you do? I'm an uh, engineer of geology. Uh-huh. Yeah. And so you have an official card. Yeah. Like geologist. With your photo on it. Yay. <laughs> Fantastic. <no. laughs> okay, good to meet you. The people will, will n love to know that you are you and your good energy are working for the pyramids. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Always. <laughs> and that's not that's Namik in the background. He works hard too. So what's your job here for the foundation? Uh, me? Well, I'm, well, I'm an, a research archaeologist. So I'm here offering um, just archaeological support um, because I mean, th there's been archaeological support from previous years, but it's dwindling, so I'm just here offering my support. Right, and... Um, and also for personal reasons, research and you know, public archaeology, tourism. Because you're that. interested personally in what's happening up here in Visoko. Yes. Yeah. I'm interested in uh, the way the public views the site. Um, I'm interested in archaeological tourism in general in Bosnia because I think it's it's necessary to help the economy and what else? and also to help the project, which is why it's a bit more tourist orientated this year. I think that's the whole plan is to try and get some more funding for the research you know, for future years. So when the when the um, volunteers come to Visoko to help on the project, what do you do with them? What's your job to, to help them? Right, so um, MRAV is the, the volunteer project that's been running since 2010. I was there in 2010 as a volunteer. And even then I was working, I was offering my archaeological, let's say, skills, even though I was at university then, uh, just to try and... The thing is, volunteers, when they come, they want to help, obviously. You just have to try and hone in on what they're good at and then spread them out. So some people are good at making steps, you know, they're good at construction work. So we put them, you know, making steps, handrails, just different elements of tourist infrastructure. Other people are good at I mean, gardening, so, you know, we put them to clean up the vegetation. And then you have younger people, which are you know, which we use for digging. <laughs> and I've done everything, so <laughs> I've done everything. Yeah, because you were here in 2000 and... 2010, 10. 11, 12 and 14. Oh, That's okay. my fifth year. And this year I'll also be um, offering 
archaeological seminars and workshops to tourists who are interested, who are coming to do the volunteering as well for four days, just to give them a bit more insight into what the project is about. And when they do the volunteering work, so that they have a bit more understanding of what we're looking for and what our purpose here is. I see myself still as a team player and a volunteer <laughs> because it's all about teamwork here. To try and make the, you know, to improve the situation, I think every year, if you want to improve the situation, if you want to you know, um, continue the research, I think you need to engage people more in, um, you know, engage people's opinions more as well. That's what I want to say. Mm -hmm. Because it's not just about coming here and digging. That's why when I have volunteers working here and I'm telling them where to work, I work alongside them, which is what not many archaeologists do. Uh -huh. But I dig, you know, I, I clean the, the roots. I've been, well, I usually do this work with volunteers and I've been doing uh -huh. it with Maida and some of the foundation workers and you know we're doing it now all by ourselves you're just up here by yourself uh, on the biggest pyramid in the world uh, cleaning pine Checking needles the off the, and you know so that's it doesn't look like a lot but it makes a difference because when a tourist comes down here and they see that yeah. it's been cleaned yeah they can see it's active and i think that's what's important is to yes. see that it's still active that it hasn't been left <coughs> neglected you know the signs are up you can read all about the the information you know, pertaining to the actual excavations and to the research project. We'll uh, let you get back to work. I'm finished with work. It is good. To, oh, you're finished now. <laughs> thank goodness. I need a break as well. Okay. Well, well, thank you again, Anella, and uh, we look forward to seeing more videos uh, with you explaining all the amazing things about the Bosnian Pyramid Complex. Thank you.